Hello guys, welcome to our channel. Today we are preparing curd chicken. Chicken with curd. This is the new special dish we are bringing only from Hyderabad. This is Hyderabad special dish, chicken curry. Okay, so for this we need a uh, onion. So this onion is like two pieces of two onions and one tomato. Chopping. So you can do the choppings here like this. The straight chopping, then this one, the square type of okay. Then we have coriander leaves, okay. Next, we need a uh, flour, okay, and we need a uh, ginger garlic paste. Also, we need a uh, curd, okay. Also, you can see we have uh, all type of chilies, spices, you can add it for as per your needs. Okay, okay, let's guy. We'll start the preparation. So we need a uh, hundred gram oil. So we'll put in the can, pan. Okay, let's add some cumin seeds. Okay, now we'll add some long and lychee. One one piece is enough. Okay. Okay, let's add the onion now. So this is uh two this is the top onion, so we took some two onion for this. So we'll cook this onion till it will become brown. A little brown. Now we'll add a ginger garlic paste. So one spoon ginger garlic paste. Now stir. Okay, stir till it to nicely cook. So we need the onion to be a little brown so stir so it won't get burnt. So it's uh, becoming a see you can see the nice uh, brown nice color you with more a uh, bit more brownish okay now the onion is uh, brown slightly brown so now this is good this look good so we'll add some some chilies so we took like two chilies. If you want more spicy, then you can add more chilies. Two is enough for us. Maybe you can add ten as per your spices. As per your taste. Okay, let's add one tea, uh, one spoon uh, uh, salt. A uh, little bit uh, turmeric powder. Let's add uh, one spoon chili powder, red chili powder. Let's add a little bit more. Okay, now let's add tomatoes. So we took like one tomato. Okay, we add. Uh, we we took a big tomato. If you are taking a small, then we add two tomato. Now cook this 
until the tomatoes uh, uh, leave their juice yes. and so we'll close the lid so it become a bit uh, gravy so we we'll wait for it so almost like 5-10 minutes so we'll come back after 5-10 minutes so guys the gravy is almost ready so you can see okay, okay so let's let's see our main ingredient okay let's go and see our main ingredient so our, so here comes our main ingredient the yeah, chicken Ooh, chicken juicy wow so we took some 200 gram of chicken so you don't need the full boneless you can take uh, uh, bone with bone also as well okay so this is around 200 gram so you can see how this looks freshy chicken okay let's let's do the next thing okay so take the chicken piece put in the flour okay now we are going to do it okay like this you have to dip in the flour okay nicely wow this look good okay so it observe the watery okay we'll do this for all the chicken pieces now okay just took a chicken piece then put in the flour back to the dish again repeat it we'll do it same thing for all the chicken pieces okay jump in the plate okay took from the bowl dip in the flour back to the plate okay we'll repeat this okay you guys can do it we'll we'll come back after doing all this okay okay guys uh, we covered all the chicken pieces with the flour so you can see how it looks okay we'll add the chicken pieces now Yeah, here go the chicken in the fry pan. Yoo! Yeah, mother, yeah, pan mother. Yoo! Chicken is going in the pan. Dip, dip, dip. Hooray! Chicken jumping in the pan. Tat, tat, tat. All chicken in the pan. You can see, guys. So now we stir the wheel. Stay the spoon, guys. Don't be, huh? Don't go in car, huh? Okay, just do a stirring. So here the all masalas, everything will mix well with the chicken pieces. The floor will absorb all these things. Okay. So guys, as the name suggested, this is a cut with chicken. So now the second main ingredient, curd. So we'll add curd. So you can add more curd. So we are taking like 200 gram. You can add more as well because uh, this is the this is also an other main ingredient after the next to the chicken. Okay, now stir the spoon so well so and make it well cook no. okay now let's we add this uh, water two cups of water so here goes one cup Now we'll add the chopped coriander leaves for some nice flavors, nice aroma. Now stir it till it well cook. Mix it well, then close the lid. So we'll cook this for uh, 20 another minutes. So let's come. Yeah. 
is our main tip don't leave it for 20 minutes our otherwise our chicken will fly away so let's open in between and mix it well like this so your chicken won't burn and it won't hurt because later it's going to be in our stomach so prepare it nicely mix it well in between then close the lid again okay we'll do it we'll do this uh, mixing like every 5 minutes okay then after all 20 minutes our chicken will be ready now i can feel the nice aroma wow mm. Gee, so delicious now only it's giving so much oh i can't say it okay let's come back in another 10 minutes now now after long 30 minutes our chicken is ready so mix up mix it well now see all water is so the chicken is ready now now the chicken is ready you can see wow it has it's got a nice flavor wow so amazing aroma Ooh. okay guys uh, now you can also try this recipe at your homes and don't forget to leave your comments you can serve it with rice or chapatis as per your needs okay guys you try this and leave your feedbacks oh girls don't be afraid you also can do it okay let's see who comment first okay it's an open challenge who goes first girls or boys i leave up to you okay let's see you in other video bye enjoy eating, enjoy eating. Enjoy let me try a piece now wow this is so nice let me try it wow this is so mm, so delicious wow this chicken is so soft yummy yum. mm. this is so yummy okay guys i'll go to enjoy this chicken you guys also try it okay bye good night see you in next video till that I am enjoying my chicken. Bye.